New at 6.30, the Pittsburgh City Controller is calling for changes to the Pittsburgh Bureau of Police. After conducting an audit along with the Citizen Police Review Board, he says they found some alarming disparities in policing. As Chris Hoffman reports, the goal of the report is to foster more equitable policing. In the whole report, there are 23 recommendations from the City Controller's Office to the Pittsburgh Bureau of Police. Now, according to police, many of them are something they can work on to improve their services. One of the biggest numbers of policing was marijuana. The city has decriminalized small amounts, but the state and federal governments have not. So that leaves charges up to the officers. And the report says that 85% of arrests in the city for marijuana possession are African-American men and women. That can't be right. right? That, that shows their need for change. That shows uh, an inequity. Other calls for change include allowing the Citizens Police Review Board to audit body camera footage and the monitoring of officers for any connection to hate groups. Screening it um, in the course of their employment is a check and a balance to assuring that the standards are being upheld. Well, for some advocate groups, the recommendations leave a lot to be desired. Vaughn Walker Montgomery with Take Action Mon Valley says relations are beyond repair. She says a better recommendation would have been for officers to learn to deal with underserved communities. Because it's been proven that the issues with police have been with um, communities of color. They have been with um, LGBTQIA plus community, trans community. Her organization advocates for defunding of police toward abolition. And rebuilt back up with the uh, with the people in mind. The Pittsburgh Bureau of Police agreed with 22 of the recommendations. They disagreed with the audit of body camera footage citing state law. According to Mayor Ed Ganey's office, this is a step toward healing community relations, and they're looking forward to unveiling their plan on police reform soon. We've also got a lot of work to do and, and, and getting to a point where we have a city uh, and a police response that doesn't just protect and defend, um, but, uh, but, but that also does it in a fair and equitable way. Now to see that full report and all 23 recommendations from the city controller, Head on over to our website as well as our app. Outside Pittsburgh Police Headquarters, Chris Hoffman, KDKA News.